Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Modded Minecraft with Tri-X2. Um, I, so, last episode was a, kind of a short one, and I showed you the huge journey I took looking for and not finding any cactus whatsoever. Um, and, oops, lag there. This episode, these are actually what I needed, or what I can use instead. And we're gonna get some bees going so I can get flowers easier. But, um, basically, in these chests are the. all the stuff that I gathered in that massive long journey throughout all those uh, villages. And I'm actually gonna go in and grab out. I actually ran into a, um, flower forest biome, and so, that's why I, there's a whole bunch of flowers mixed in and stuff. Now, I will be clearing out those, excuse me, we'll be slowly clearing out those chests, but for right now, what we're gonna do is go upstairs, and we're going to have to reconfigure this place, I need more storage space, um, Oh, uh, you know what? I have magnet mode turned on. Um, there, we're just going to... Nope, stop it. Stop it, thank you. Hey, as it turns out, that's just the perfect amount. Um, so, what we're going to do... Oh, you're a wooden fight. Alright, uh, that'll work. So, yeah, what the plan is... Is... Um... Apparently the plan is to make more storage drawers. It's okay, I can do that. I have a rather gratuit gratuitous amount of wood. Um, here you go. Away. Um, no, get over there. So there's eight chests. more wood here, and this will make um, eight of these 4x4 four four storage drawers. Yeah. Um, but like I said, yeah, mostly what I, so right now what I need is really more storage. And that's actually a complete storage wall. I should be able now to Yeah, we're gonna grab some cord stone here. Yeah. And some andesite. And limestone. This is a chisel 2 limestone, but I believe... You know what? Give me that. Let's see, where's my bag? I believe if I take the chisel and stick this limestone in there... Yes, I can convert chisel limestone to engineer's toolbox limestone. Oops, uh, which is good. So it means, and like I said, we're gonna have to repair the arm and hammer, and the shovel's not so bad. I could, I've repaired that several times. Moment. But uh, yeah, there, uh, I've got rather a lot of stuff, and one of the th one of the things that we need to do, absolutely essential, is to construct a drawer controller. And that's this. Okay, so drawer stone, redstone comparators. Um, you know what? I can do that. That's not very hard. Let's see. One, two, three, six. I don't believe I have sticks on me. I do not have sticks on me. All the stuff that I do have, and then sticks are the one thing I don't have. Alright. Uh, and you. Um, I need plain stone. <laughs> Who'd have thought that plain stone would be something that I was basically out of? Oops. Uh, 
I'm not too worried about that. There's more cobblestone. Yeah. So, yeah. We're just gonna let that cook up real quick. Um. So I need a diamond. Diamond. Yeah. No. So it's just chest and wood planks. I can do that. Um. Oh, I didn't need to do that. Pfft. Brain is fuzzy right now. Um. So it's just one chest. I'm looking for the. Um. Steve's factory manager, not factory manager, Steve's workshop. Oops. Here, let me get my quartz is up there. My intention is as soon as possible to upgrade to, um, stored. Drawer controller. Boom. There. So if I grab that and put that in there. Okay, so one of the things I'm going to have to do is go through and um, organize all this stuff. And I won't do all of that on camera, but I can grab this dirt and this dirt and uh, this cobblestone. Oops. If you haven't seen storage drawers before, you're well. Ah. Let me indoor. Thank you. You're missing out on a treat. Basically, just oh, double right click on that. And there's no dirt storage. Well, that's because I have a double chest for dirt. Because I have way too much dirt. Um. Yeah. So. Ah, an obsidian crossbar. Not a copper sword blade. I picked up some of this, some stuff from the Tinker's Houses because the chests and um. Um, the chest, you know what, I'm going to take that and melt it down. Um. Yeah. I am brilliant. Yeah. The, uh, chests and workshop tables have, typically have Tinker's tool parts in them. And one of the things that I wanted is a rapier because stick there and a stick is because a lot of enemies that I encountered but of the enemies I did encounter had, were wearing um, metallurgy not metallurgy mechanism mechanism armor and oh I know what that's for um we're gonna build a mechanism pump and pump. I'm gonna make a cut. All right. Let me slow down a little bit. <clears throat> so what I'm going to do is I'm still going to try and do lava, but I'm having some trouble with my railcraft setup. I built a track, and it runs in there. And I need some lava and some other bits and bobs in order to make make it go through the the <laughs> nether rack. Net yeah, nether, nether portal on its own. And because it doesn't want to do that, it's... Excuse me. Sorry. Um, that's actually what I went looking for cactus for, was in order to make a passive anchor 
put on this side and to go with the one that's on the other side. And I was completely unable to find cactus. So for now, what I'm actually going to do is, well, I'm going to flip these over. Ah, no. You know what? I, I need some redstone. Six and and if I take this and my wooden pipes, I get a bunch of no. Uh, that's a Tinker's Construct Torch instead of a Minecraft one. Excuse, and excuse me. Hmm. And now I can connect them with... I need more cobblestone. Uh, well... No, I don't. I put them away? I think I put them away in a chest. Ah, the one that I... Oh, the other one's still up there. Um... Is it? Crud. Crud, I lost the pipe. Well, it's not like these are the, the... These are neither the most expensive nor the best pipes in the world, so... <clears throat> and they're not exactly hard to make, either. Um, I think you can make them with clear glass. And yes, I took two, because... I think I need more. But... So, like this? No. Okay. Well, that's fine. I have an absolute monster load of sand. Um, so, yeah. I don't need this anymore. Yeah, quite clear glass. This will work either. Nope. Okay. So if I just take this and see, there we go. All right. So if fourteen redstone should be enough for what I'm after. Um. So I'm actually going to take half of this and half of these and grab them. recall if it will put output to a wooden pipe like that. Not a wooden pipe. Or output without a wooden pipe. And the answer is no. Okay. That's fine. I can I can deal with that. So what we do is we go and we put this down like so. Like so. And we should... Transport pipe. Um, wooden transport pipes can actually accept power. It seems silly at first glance, but you realize until you realize that they can. There we go. Oh, there's the blue line. It was just hidden by the. So if we make, oh, no, nope, we don't need to make one more. We can just plug that in there. Okay. So what else these need? is water and coal. Um, coal's not actually so hard. <coughs> we can use charcoal. Water? There's not a lot of water here. But if I take my axe... And I still haven't given up on magma. I went to a 
lot of effort. That's the last one. No. That one is. Okay. So my plan is to put my water intake here and run a rail cart down to the water there. <clears throat> now to do that, we're going to need a pump. And the best type of pump we can use is actually... Where's my... There it is. Is actually the... Um... Excuse me, I'm getting sidetracked here again. My brain is fizzling. Ah. The best type of pump available is actually a mechanism pump, which is what I had these for. Um, no. not actually a difficult recipe. It does take some steel and some osmium, but I have iron. And I suspect I have osmium. I have to check though. Let's see. Well, there's two osmium. And that's lead. Dark steel and thomium. Alright, that's not that hard to deal with. Grab some osmium. That'll give me two. And then I need some iron. I don't have iron here, but that's okay. I have iron out on my boat. Um, of course, finding it is a whole separate matter. More dark steel. We even got some vibrant alloy. Yeah, some vibrant alloy, which will be helpful later. Uh, more thomium, redstone alloy, and electrical steel. Uh, with the electrical steel, I can actually make a yetterich. Aha, here we go, iron ore. So, the plan is to get water running up in a railcraft uh, tank cart. <coughs> In order to do that, we need a tank cart. So... Nope, not you. Here. I'm going to stick this here, let this provide what power it's necessary, while we get... Um, okay, there's iron. We're going to put on a rolling machine. And we're going to put four ingots in here and tell it to craft. And we're going to break this. grab out the rest of our levers and what we're going to do is put them here and here move that over again now that you've got that we're going to break you because you're going to continue to eat power um, we're going to let you suck up that osmium so that it gets smelted You're not pushing. Alright, you're gonna do that. I'm going to eat many carrots. And then. Alright, I have a. Tr I have a few carts which I have acquired with. Um, in my travels. That one will work. We need is surprisingly enough more glass. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, tank. Okay, so we need iron tank gauges, which is glass panes. I need one more sand. Great. So we go up here, not you, we go here, <sighs> go.
Go in there. Thank you. Now, if I actually grab this and switch it to push-pull mode, it will as soon as it gets rid of the sand suck out of the top of the chest. Yes, there we go. See? So in a moment, we will have our glass, and we can make our panes, and we can make ourselves a chest cart. Now, I have more locking tracks. I think I'm going to need more boosters. Um... In fact, I'm pretty sure I am. Let me sleep again. Um, one moment. Uh, back again, sorry. So, make ourselves some glass panes. One, two, three, four, five. I hear you, and I hear you, Mr. Ackerman. This makes a bunch of iron tank gauges. You put one of those in to, on top of a tank cart, and now you... Er, on top of a mine cart, and boom, now you have a tank cart. I'm gonna go ahead and put this in here. And that. Um, I actually have an iron chisel head in one of the chests, and I want to use it use that to make a tinker's chisel because there's a few cool things you can do with a tinker's chisel that you can't do with any other chisels. So now we need to get water from up from uh, not water train tracks from up there to down here. Let me think of the best way to do it. Uh, I have a shovel. I have a shovel in my bag. Come here shovel. Really? Really, shovel? You're gonna be like that? Fair enough. Um, I actually have just cobblestone in here from where I was digging channels. No, not you. There. So, what I intend to do is... Uh, I'm actually gonna smooth this out a little bit. Huh. <sighs> I am going to take this sugar cane and move it over a little. Let's see. I have track. Um, you know what? It occurs to me it might actually be better to use some elevator track. Elevator track is actually pretty cool. Okay, it's advanced rail and a standard rail and some redstone. I have all that. Yeah. Alright, so advanced rail. And standard rail. And then redstone's inside. So the plan is uh, redstone. The plan is to not leave this sorting system, or unsorting system. Uh, we'll see how that goes. I have any eye, just shift click it. I'm going to do two sets of that. Excuse me. Now, can I put on... No. Okay. Now, you can actually use this as um, ladders. So... And birch planks. <sighs> this sorting system will be replaced. Well, no, no, it won't. Okay. That's not fair to say. Two, I think it's three. The sorting system will be updated to become a logistics pipe based sorting system. 
as soon as I can get reliable power and um, okay and now I need regular track and another lever actually so I have give me a cobble Alright, so now I got right, so now I got track. And give me, give me a stack of track. You know what? I'm gonna put the extra track away in it shortly anyway, so there's no reason not to grab it all right now. But essentially Alright. What you wanna do is this. This is what you want. What you want to do is run your redstone. Just run your uh, elevator track all the way there. I'm gonna have to make a switch track. At least one. Um that's not really difficult. I think I'm short a couple of standard rails. Which is annoying but not insurmountable. Yep, alright, I am definitely short some rails. Um I'll organize that shortly. I, that's gonna be a repeating that is going to be a re let me in the house, thank you. A repeating thing. I'm going to say that, and I'm never going to get it done. It's reinforced rail again. Rails. Rail is actually a very simple recipe. It is six iron or six steel. And then we just click to craft it. I'll use a little bit of power. But... It makes 16 rail, and then we break that again, because, yeah. So, now if we go here, it's rail like that. Oops, wrong button. <clears throat> and I need, alright, here. We'll put that all away. And, um, got a bucket. Need slabs. So, I'm going to rush over here, and I'll show you the nether track in just a minute. Um, the um, thing that's floating above those right now, because I don't have um, <laughs> the creosote in there, is actually a oh, seriously? drying rack from Tinker's Construct. And you can use that and make um, monster jerky. And one more. Uh, out of zombie flesh. And then we take this. And a wooden railroad. Rail, rail bread? Rail bed. And plunk it here. And we get 16 switch tracks. Switch tracks can be switched, well, by a switch motor. But, we don't actually need that for what we're doing here. All we need to do is plunk that down, and it's facing the wrong way. Because of course it is. Alright, you know what? Here, I can open up a little bit of room in my inventory by thumping that down. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna have to put some boosters in here. But I need that. And I need that. Now, if you just right-click it with a wrench, it flips the direction. Now I need bricks and glass. Great. There, you know what? Let me get some sand out of this one. Yeah, I have 
Lots of sand. I have lots of sand and no inventory space. Uh, between. Oops. Ooh, I'm at the, actually at the 30 minute mark. Alright, I'm going to... Alright, here, real quick. I'm going to set the sand into to cooking up. And get some... I'll probably fire up two or three of these engines with some coal, charcoal. Oh, I had exactly six. So... I have a rail crash. Oh, I, I know where the, mic oh. the tank is. Um, okay, so I'm going to take this coal and get some water and fire up these engines and get all that sand cooked down. And I'm going to move a bunch of stuff off camera and hopefully I'll be better organized by the time I come back. Yeah... Probably not. Uh, see you next time.